Hi guys, welcome to Safi Mixed. In this video, I will let you know how to count the number of ticks which represent the progress of a salesman or the successes of a student and a number of different tests from a very large data of an Excel sheet like the one you see over here. So to begin with, I have presented a sample of uh, the number of students or salesmen in here. In the top, I have written uh, tests or uh, test or any successes you can write over here and here i consider qualified or progress you can write progress or qualified and i want to add uh, the uh, check boxes into this and then in the qualified column it will show me the progress or the counting of the checks of the data so to this end put your cursor in the uh, first quiz column in column c and then come to insert tab in here, click on checkbox. A checkbox is added, and then put your cursor on the small square in the bottom of the cell and drag it to down to this. So I have put the checkbox in the whole row. And then again, I put my cursor on the small square and drag it down to fill the rows for every client or every cell man. And here in the qualified column, I write a code equal then count f parenthesis and then i select the range and uh, then i put comma and i write true and then i close the parenthesis and i click enter then i again put the cursor in the same cell and put my cursor on the small square and drag it down to select for all the uh, students now, if I click on a checkbox, a tick will be added and it is counted over here. Similarly, I add another one, so two will be counted. I put another one over here, and you keep on ticking a checkbox, and the number of checkbox in a given row will be counted and be added in the qualified uh, check. So this way, you can count the number of checks for a very large number of data uh, on the Excel sheet. And thanks for watching.